Welcome to Newslink, I'm Nina Cash. I'm in the Port of Long Beach in California this morning where it's all about the MTOP program, the Marine Terminal Operations Professional Program offered at California State University Long Beach through the Center for International Trade and Transportation. On this segment, you'll learn all about the different occupations and jobs one can earn once they earn this professional designation. It's a very well put together program by industry experts and who have designed the program to be taught um, in a way that it can be understood uh, because everything new looks huge and complicated but we've broken it down when they get hired in our industry uh, shipping, trucking, any transportation that they can walk in and hit the road running without looking lost. We live and work near the ports every day, but we really don't understand how these terminals operate. Design professionals that are in our field, I would highly recommend the program because it's much more involved than we initially thought. We drive by every day, we see um, a parking lot full of chassis. We don't know why they're all there and why they're stored in that location, for example. This class has already given me an entire background on how that operates, how it works, and who's responsible for that. So it's, it's that sort of understanding at a very deep level that is extremely valuable um, as a consultant. We went over the equipment and uh, the different types of cranes. I didn't know that there's gantry cranes, whirly cranes, uh, monk cranes, all this type of stuff you learn in the, uh, the uh, classroom setting, a more comfortable classroom setting, uh, definitely helps with your success in uh, going into the position. This program has benefited Ports America in that it's given our managers an opportunity to learn more about terminal operations. For example, if a manager is working uh, at a container site, they have the opportunity to go into the classroom and learn about brake bulk and row row. My students come from various uh, background. Companies are sending their superintendents to learn more and refine themselves and equip them better in their own companies. So the MTOP program is being used even for the industry. Our managers gain industry and operations knowledge and the coursework is relevant to their daily responsibilities. They can take what they learn in the classroom and apply it immediately to their job. This program is one of the only programs I've been able to find out here on the West Coast to help develop terminal operations managers. You know, one course that I really do remember was the terminal tour over at Maersk. And, uh, you know, it was after we learned everything in the program, we got to actually go on the terminal instead of just, you know, looking at PowerPoint. And they brought us on top of a uh, gantry crane and we were hundreds of feet in the air, walking around on the boom, walking out over the, uh, the water. Uh, I'll never, you know, forget that experience. It was, it was really fun. I had no idea of the um, relationship between management and labor at the ports and it's very involved, there's a lot of nuances to it and to learn about that and understand it has been very interesting. I would recommend this program to all of my industry peers, to um, HR professionals, training and development professionals, um, site managers. What has been the outcome of graduates in this program? That's interesting you should ask that question, Regina. Uh, this program has helped people to get jobs. I hired two in my class. So I teach the students uh, in a way uh, to understand labor relations, also to interview. They are interviewing for a job because the people who are teaching the classes are from the industry. I really enjoyed it. It's been a great, great program. Consider the Marine Terminal Operations Professional Program at California State University, Long Beach. Thanks for watching this segment of Newslink. I'm Nina Cash. We'll see you next time.